welcome back to my channel today um it's saturday so i'm thinking of um cleaning my top stove you get so frustrated where it's like there's like a ring on it even though you clean it so much it's still there and so with this time um i went ahead and did something that really cleaned it up so stay tuned hello hello everyone welcome back to my channel don't forget to subscribe and if you do like it give it a thumbs up and share and don't forget to hit the bell button for further notification okay everyone so this is my stove top so if you can see all that gunk in there so basically what I'm gonna be using is this um, ceramic bright cooktop and also I'll be using is these mini scrapers okay and also you can use some towels to use for that as well all right so what first thing we're gonna do is gonna go ahead and wet it with a sponge wet it around there all around so as you can see even though you wipe it see that ring around that thing Ugh, so frustrating how to cook when it goes like that so gonna go ahead and wet it some more on there all right okay so once we wet it so we're gonna go ahead and see how that clean that round edges cuss whatever that is over cook spilled okay so we're gonna go ahead <laughs> and um, uh, pour some of this around where you want to get it clean so I'm gonna put it all over the part that I need to clean up okay now we're gonna get our mini scrapers I bought this at the Dollar Tree it comes in five so what you're gonna do is usually you have to take push that there so we're gonna invert the blade so you guys be, be very careful when you put it on there so you slatch it on there Ugh. then whoops then on the back part we're gonna push that button to lock it in okay so now what we're gonna do is gonna go ahead and spread this um, coating thing that we put on there just spread it around and let it coat and at the same time what I'm doing is trying to scrape it I like um, scrape it in like um, on the side and I see how it's still not working I did this before and I still got that same thing scraping it and scraping it and over and over Okay guys, so what I'm going to go ahead and do is sprinkle a little bit more water over that. And what I'm going to go ahead and do is turn on the burner for the one I am going to start cleaning. As you can see, it's turned on. So it's just a few seconds, count to five. And then what I'm going to go ahead and do is um, turn it off. And I'm going to go ahead and start scraping. As you can see, it kind of helps it out more, getting all that gunk out. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Okay. Then I'm going to go ahead and wipe it off. As you can see, it did take off the scuff of all that was in there. So let's go ahead and do the rest. Okay.
Okay guys, as you can see, I've done the, one of the burners. So I'm going to go ahead and wipe it off with a sponge. And then wrap it up with a towel. So as you can see, it did clear up the scums on there. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I like it, so we'll go ahead and do the other parts, okay? Okay, yeah, okay, so we're going to go ahead and turn on the burner for this small part. Just a few seconds and then I'm going to go ahead and shut it off and then start scrubbing again. Okay, so I guess I'm satisfied with that part. It wasn't, it's just a small one so it didn't need a lot of scrubbing. So we're going to go ahead and wipe it off with a sponge. Okay guys, so we're going to go ahead and do the other side. Okay, turn on the burner for a few minutes and turn it off and then go ahead and scrape it again. On this, um, these one you hardly use as much as the large burner. So, okay, so we're going to go ahead and wipe it with a sponge and see how nice and clean that is. Now I'm going to clean it some more. Okay, here we go. And also we're going to start cleaning the... Um, the, those parts, the top part over there, using the same thing. So now I'm going to go ahead and use a um, rag and clean that part up again. Wipe it off. And see how nice it comes out? Perfect, perfect, perfect. Hey everyone, so it's clean. As you can see, um, the top picture is what looked like before and after. So if you guys like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share. And also um, go ahead and hit the subscription button and that bell button as well for further notification. Until then, see you guys later.